Hi y'all, I'm back to over here, maker of all the fun things on Shop St. Florence, and I'm back with another video. I'm prepping this week for the launch of my uh, online store, and I just wanted to do like a week in the life of the ceramic artist slash business owner, and y'all follow along with me. So this week we are prepping for so this week we are prepping for the storefront and there's a lot to do. But since I'm relaunching the business, one of the things I really want to do is rebrand my website. And at the moment, it's just like a landing page that just says launch happening soon. And I have a link to my first YouTube video, but there you can't see any of the shop products or any of that stuff. So I really want to just like revamp the style and make it feel and look like this new summer collection where it's bright and airy and summery. Um, and so that's a big thing that I want to work th on this week is the design of how that looks like. And also I need to consider the inventory of the products that I need to include online. There's, I have over 30 products that I'm launching and so I need to upload all those things. So one of the things I need to do is create a social strategy for this week, just um, figuring out all the things that I want to post on Instagram and YouTube. And I'm going out of town um, for July 4th and I'm going camping. So I want to figure out if I'm going to post or schedule a post for while I'm out in the middle of the woods and I don't have service and just want to relax. Or do I want to not have anything scheduled at all and not post? The thing that I need to do ASAP is order all of my packaging. And I've been procrastinating on that. And I can't procrastinate anymore because I have to have that either before launch or by like the first or second day. So I need to order all of my packaging. And hmm, what else do I need to do? I just, actually, so I, I did write all of this down in a journal and then I put it on Notion. So I'll send you, I'll actually like put it off to the side here um, of a checklist so you can have it too. But I kind of just I recognize that as you are working on your business for whatever you do, I just feel like you kind of like learn as you go. And um, I, I feel like I have been learning a lot of things. It's, it's hard. It feels like you keep on like trying to find things on YouTube on like, what do I need to do to prep? But there's just always something that you don't really know about. So I'll, I'll share what I, what checklists I'm doing. Um, and then one of the things that I just did uh, was a pop-up launch as a piece of the prep for next week and, and just more marketing. So I need to um, since I did the pop-up, I recorded some footage of it and I need to upload that to my computer and edit that into a video. I wanna, want that to be like a long form video and maybe one or two shorts out of it. So it, yeah, the moment just feels like there's a lot to do and I probably won't be able to get to everything, but that's just kind of what I've been thinking about. So I'm launching it on 7-7 at 5 p.m. It's a Sunday night. Also, it's a good strategy. I was thinking of like, when are people going to be back home um, on the computer just chilling? And I think like the following week, people are probably going to be busy back at work. But like I think Sunday evening is a great day to start it. And it will last throughout the week until next Sunday.
so I've been researching um, which packaging I should do and um, I can't make the decision whether I should buy a thermal printer. And this is kind of like the research. <laughs> I've been using this like orange jelly roll pen, but I love the pens, but um, yeah, this is my scribbles on just packaging, shipping cost, and yeah. Okay, so right now I'm making stickers as part of my packaging. Um, this will go in, in like, you know, when I wrap the ceramics up in the protective um, layer, I will seal it with this cute little sticker of my logo. And then I also have like another one of just my basic logo lock up and this will be a cutout. And I'm placing an order right now on Vinyl Discord. They have a sale right now, 25% off um, for the 4th of July holiday. Yes, I'm doing this very late. Um, and so look at that, like that's a really good deal for 350 orders of stickers. That's 150 stickers. Um, so I'm hoping this will last me for two to three months and I'm about to place that order. Here we go, checking out. My shop is finally up. I'm so happy. Um, it took me literally all day to do, but here we are. 
um, I love the bright colors. It just reminds me of summer and I was just trying to give like a cheery vibe to the whole essence of it. And so um, the shop page has different categories, cups, bowls, sets, mugs, all different types of things. And just go in there and take a look. But most of the day, finishing my online store. I can't talk because I'm tired, um, but I feel relieved. I'm glad it happened today. Seven, seven is a good number for me. And so I really wanted to get it in today. And I also kind of like waited because I know last week was a major holiday. So um, I'm glad it's up and I look forward to seeing like any progress or any activity on there um i know a few of my friends have already been on the store and so that feels really good that they've already supported me like right when i posted but i will be back tomorrow to um kind of wrap up um my prep for the online store even though the store is finally launched i get my boxes tomorrow and i also get the stickers and the labels and one thing i haven't gotten and i'm still trying to figure out what i should do is an uh a shipping label printer should i just go to usps every single time i don't know that's probably time i know time is money but i'll figure that out i'm gonna do all that tomorrow um and I'm just really thankful and um, just thankful for today that um, I've made it to this point. I know this has been like a long journey for me um, and, and just like boosting my confidence and my self-worth of who I am and in showing my work and my talent from over the years. I feel very blessed and thankful and so um, I think this is a, definitely a new chapter for me and I'm excited to see like what happens next.